Uh, is everyone else going? Is everyone uh, anything else anyone wants to do in the middle of the? Ernest feels. I was happy to kind of a little bit more rest. Uh, I think she's also looking forward to the next morning, asking about that curious whistle that. Uh, okay. I'll ask you, did you give him his whistle back? I, I would have put, put the whistle back in the ah, out. Good deal. <laughs> oh, man, think of all the trouble that might have caused if we'd messed with that thing. Mm. Okay. Okay. Cool. Uh, go. Would you like to give me uh, an alertness roll? <laughs> uh, you get a plus one column shift because you have a nice alert. Um, a, a natural 89 and my alertness is 19 so I, I'm another awesome on that okay so. cool um, you absolutely then uh, almost supernaturally aware that somebody is outside your cabin as you awoken by their like the Changing air pressures and things. It's, a, it's, a, it's the Wolverine <laughs> thing. I smell. Yeah. I smell a plot. I smell the plot Indeed. coming. <laughs> so you're absolutely ready and prepared if you want to be as somebody starts opening your cabin. No, oh, I kind of like that creak. Wow. Mm. I think what would happen is. have my my axe at the ready but i'm i'm not going to get up out, out of the back to to get some shut eye that i i get woken up by this so you sorry you're um axe at the ready but pretending you're still asleep right. okay um so uh with your awesome role, clearly this is, uh, you're more than uh, uh, able to pull this off and uh, you see Adolfo coming through the door, um, looking around, walking towards to kneel down next to your bed. Um, Adolfo? Reach out a, Adolfo. Reach out a hand towards you. Very Dracula esque. Anything you'd like to do? Uh, I think if he's reaching down to me. Catch it to the face. No, no, shh, Rod. I like it when Robbie does it on purpose. <laughs> <laughs> we'll, we'll, we'll spring up, catch it in hand. I, I, she, he, she's not going to immediately hack him, but I think she's going to. Oh come on! Of all the people, <laughs> uh, you know, definitely uh, pummel him. Oh, you're a brawler too. That's true. Brawler. Okay. To try to and use the hatchet, but not the sharp end of it. <laughs> it's just uh, okay. uh, the pummeling end of the hatchet. Yeah. That's fine. You can spin it around and hit him with it over the head if you like. Um, where are they? There's some noise about this. This Okay, doesn't really matter. Uh, so, um, it sounds like it's a pretty direct attack. Uh, to lay him out, uh, you get uh, plus one column to what I assume is raw. Yeah, it's definitely brawling because hitting people with clubs. I rolled a good, but with plus one column, it'll make it a great result. Okay. Cool. Uh, so he's shocked and uh, uh, not expecting you to leap up out of the bed. I would imagine. Uh, and. Uh, takes a 
I imagine it sounded like a fist to the face and then the back end of the hatchet to the other side. Uh, knocking him back and away from you. Um, you have the upper hand briefly if you wanted to do anything. Continue to try and beat him up. Uh, let me know. Um, back around so that the... And I yell out, Morning Star. Morning Star. I tell Adolfo, you stay right there. Wait, Shining that. Star or Morning Star? Shining Star. Right, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Just check you. Okay. So, uh, so I'm great. Opinions. Yeah. Do I need to roll to see whether I sleep through this or not, or what is? What do you say, Ross? Um. Yes, but you're going to get a plus two column shift because it's been a disturbed night and everyone's on. I was going to uh, say, well, on my alertness, uh, finally. I will. I will also roll to wake up. Okay, well, Go. I'm going by alertness. Is that correct? Or listen? Whichever? Yeah. Okay. Uh, alertness. Okay, so um, I roll a ninety-three, which puts me at Ooh. oh shit, just under an awesome result. That's really annoying. Well, I'll just sit bolt upright, having heard, like, everything, maybe even retroactively, like what I heard when I was asleep or something, because it's superior. Sit up, and I will shout, in exasperation, Dana's Peaks and Valleys, which is very, 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 very crude in the original Elfish. And so, um, and, and bound out to wherever I need to be. This is not a good place for bow fighting, unfortunately. Um, so I will only have, so I will actually be weaponless. Um, I roll a good. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. You are also uh, oh. aware of the, um, uh, the call for help from, um, the cabin next door. Uh, are you also charging in? Uh, no, I am, uh, distracting myself from the dogs, uh, casually looking around for a, pole or stick of any kind. You have a spear, I imagine. Okay, if we're saying I took my spear, I will uh, fling my spear over my shoulder and... Uh, you, you didn't sell it, so I'm like... Pad out, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it just feels weird to... I just still can't really picture us as medieval adventurer people. It's like hard to imagine. Yeah, I know the the. It makes perfectly sense, good sense that you know, girl runs around with an axe, but the whole thing of us yeah. festooned with, you know, military style weaponry just isn't working for me either. Yeah. Um, yeah. I actually kind of liked Shining Star. Just has a bow. I don't have any other weapons, so cool. I kind of like. Uh, I, I have kind of semi imagined the hill folk looking a bit like um, the Riders of Rowan in Lord of the Rings. In a oh, sort okay. Of Westerny well. sort of way, but. If that doesn't work for you either, then feel free to have a very, very small spear that counts as a spear but doesn't like Yeah, it. yeah, yeah, a spear. I, it's fine. I'll, I'll take a spear or a staff. Maybe just a stick that okay. is still covered under the pole on rubric. All right. Well, so anyway, uh, yes. we're, we're there yeah, at, the, yeah. at the room, and Christabel is making her way there, I suppose, as okay, I stick cool. my head in. And uh, and and look at look at him and say, "Who the hell is this?" I was making any kind of. I think I would go at him with my my hatchet, but I'm gonna at least give him a chance. A chance to talk or justify himself. Any uh, offensive action or is trying to run away? I'm gonna. Okay. Go at uh, him. So, uh, he, uh, he raises his hand to show he's unarmed. Ignoring the axe that he has in, in the belt of his, uh, his robe. Um, and, uh, he tells you he's the emissary of the ever-changing one. And the ever-changing one has business with you, girl. Religious bourgeois. I've heard of the ever-changing one, but that my people do. Some of them do. One, but I'm not. I'm not among those. Uh, 
uh, he says that your mother is one of the um, his uh, the most devout servants of the ever changing one, and um, uh, he knows if you embrace uh, uh, the, um, the teachings, you will uh, uh, benefit from it too. And how'd you get on the boat? Are you expecting to answer that? Because if you want to, you can interrogate. Uh, yeah, sure. He's already been punched in the face a couple of times. That counts, right? Uh, 70. Yeah. A good result. And I'm okay. assuming Snaps is still... Oh, he's, he's, he's stoned him out of his gourd. He's like lying there. Well, I think probably he's just naturally asleep now. But he was uh, yeah. poisoned for about an hour. Uh, I'll uh, I'll actually do a double take at snaps. It's kind of like what you're still sleeping? Holy shit! And then he's, he's <laughs> maybe kind of stirring, but I don't know. Maybe he's having a sweet and pleasant dream. Uh, Adolfo says he can show you how he got shit. No showing. No, 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 no showing. Don't weasel out of this one. <laughs> Uh, the gifts of the ever-changing one are many and miraculous, and uh, uh, I flew uh, to find my wayward daughter here. Oh, you turned it um, he didn't. Uh, he didn't happen to hear a whistle or anything. I'm going to look very sternly at girl and say that couldn't be because no one blew it, did they? Uh, so Adolfo looks over at uh, the, the still slumbering snaps and says though my uh, uh, disciple here is uh, perhaps less than entirely diligent he must have summoned me girl will reach down to that pouch and see if the if the whistle is still in there if you put it back it's still there alright well uh Go away. <laughs> no, I'm wondering whether we should keep him. Are we just... Well, I guess I started this, but I guess now we're collecting a menagerie of... Oh, a, a wolfling collection? Is that it? A petting yeah. zoo? Is that what you have in mind? Um, let's see here. Uh, actually... Uh, considering the machinations of the Unseely, the Elven Empire, the Starry Night family, uh, Modrith's band, and I'm beginning to think that it's not Modrith's band, it's your band and whatever other unverchanging priestlies there are out there. I'm figuring with all that going on, that an agent of the Elven Empire would make very, very useful work out of you. So if you don't want that to happen, which is in my power, and if you don't want Plan B, which is for your constituent parts to be floating separately somewhere between here and Smith City, I think you need to come a little cleaner with us than all this mumbo jumbo. What do you want, girl, for? Uh, do you have to bully him? Uh, no, I don't That's think I'm bullying him you. because I'm mean, I'm really, 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 really bad at that. So okay. I okay. think I'm doing a little bit more in terms of sincerity. That everything that I'm talking about should be said. I really mean what I'm saying in terms of... Okay, cool. That of, sounds good to me. I'm going to pop my question ability in case Ooh. I need to come in here. Ah, that's, what am I thinking? Why am I even Verify. talking? 
Okay, now that I now that I've talked, That's okay. you, know, you can. Well, you're the one with the interest primarily. True, basically. although and who knows? Maybe if I do well on this and I just rolled an eighty-two, it can help you in your roll, right? Anyway, let me yeah, see yeah. my. Ooh, I rolled a ninety. Ooh, hold on a second. Let me get my eighty-two. <laughs> My 82 with a sincerity of 8, that ought to be pretty good anyway. Oh, man, one point away from great. I got a good result. Okay. So at least I was uh, completely sincere in what I said. Okay. And I got superior on my interrogation role to ah, this question. thank God. Superior. So here it comes. You can have a plus one column check because of the uh, softening up. The oh, story. okay. That trying to did. That uh, doesn't get you a check mark, but it does get you a more awesome sight. Um, yeah, yeah. So that means uh, you get like XD minutes, however many. Yes. Uh, one, two, three, four. Uh, you have eight minutes of uh, one minute, okay. one, a minute getting a yes or no question. I've no idea how this is really supposed to work in reality. We work out how many minutes it comes through. Is this more or less like, like one minute per question sort of yeah. idea? Or yeah. yeah. Anyway. Well, uh, but That's a he, lot, though. Uh, Let's uh, go back to where uh, Shining Star was asking him, what do you want, girl, for? And presumably he has a response. Yes, he has. And he turns and he's facing girl. That's who he needs to speak, wants to speak to. And he says the, uh, the great hunt is coming and uh, all the wayward children of the ever-changing one uh, uh, must be there. More religious mumbo jumbo. If you want to pin him down a bit, I was going to say, is this this guy anything but a bunch of bibble? Is is there something particular about girl? I was going to say, couldn't he go run off some other wayward wolfling who's like nearer? Doesn't require a whistle, you know that kind of thing. So uh, he explains that. Um, The ever-changing one requires the uh, the most powerful, the uh, uh, most ferocious uh, wolflings to come and uh, and lead the hunt, and uh, that would be Modthrith, and that would be Girl, and and he gives like a bit of a disdaining look. Well, we like Girl. Um, you can take snaps. snaps. He gives a bit of a disdaining look towards Snaps, who clearly uh, doesn't live up to his high standards. Um, uh, but, uh, and he says, uh, your friends talk a lot, girl, but, um, uh, I'd much rather hear what you have to say about 